Let's start with the question. Does character creation dictate my role? During character creation, you select race and gender, birth sign and class, or create your own. In addition to cosmetic appearance, no matter what I select, will I be able to play different roles? Fighter, mage, and thief are the character types commonly associated with the game. Efficiently. As long. As I'm willing to develop role-specific skills. So how can we solve this? There are four possible answers. Answer 1. I've been playing Oblivion for three years now with different characters so I can share my experiences. Race. Gives you a boost on various skills. Also a great power. Adrenaline rush for red guards. Or an ability. Resist magic for Bretons. Class. More boosts on skills birth sign. It can boost a couple of skills or grant you with a great power. Take a look at this page for more information. Also previous links will help you to understand the leveling system. I do recommend playing with a custom class because default classes are not well balanced. For example the warrior has three combat skills. Blade. Blunt and hand to hand. When you will be using mainly only one. But you should play at least a couple of times in order to understand how skills work. With different characters. Then. You should start your role playing adventure. But once you get used to the game you will realize you can play any class with any character. It will be hard early in the game. For example. To play a warrior with a Breton. Due to low endurance and strength. Or a mage with a Nord. Average willpower and intelligence. But in the long run you can maximize your skills to 100. It can be a little challenging but is possible. Answer 2. Race and birth sign can give you unique abilities or attribute boosts. Class determines the starting level of each attribute. So yes, you will be able to play every roles with your character. Answer 3. It doesn't really matter, the game just isn't that difficult. However it is far, far easier to take a beefy race and make him a competent mage than it is to take a muggy race and make him a competent fighter. There are several reasons, the main being the health leveling mechanic. When you level you gain IIRC one tenth your endurance rounded down. Starting with higher endurance and maxing at first confers not just an initial boost to your starting health but a cumulative advantage in max health over the course of the game. Magic by itself as your main DPS isn't really viable unless you've got very high willpower. Lots of potions. Or both. You'll run out of Magika long before the enemies are dead. Meaning your mage will be doing some melee, especially in the earlier stages of the game. Nords start with a journeyman level destruction spell, shield, and a bonus to endurance. Orcs have berserk. And female orcs in particular have acceptable magie stats in addition to their combat prowess. Redguards don't really get any magic related cool stuff. But magic. And therefore related stats is easily leveled with cantrips. Even a few of the non-custom vanilla spells are usable. For that purpose, lowest level light, detect life, etc. Same reasoning applies to stealth. It's just easier to take a Nord or Orc and level stealth skills by taping your controller down and sneaking all night. IRL. Or. What have you. If you want the most powerful possible build. Then the arguably best race is the Breton but you'll have lower max health. The early game will be harder. It's still not that hard, etc. But 50 PTS shield and Magika resistance make them awesome. Add in one of the power signs like a Tronic, or if using magic frequently perhaps the mage. Answer 4. To answer your question in short, yes. The character creation won't affect your gameplay too much.
only look out for the main altering factors such as race and birth sign. Otherwise you can pretty much change who you want to be throughout the game. For example, different clothing and weapons can have different effects on you. You can also choose which skills you want to maximize to 100. Others can be left alone. This will also steer your character towards what you want. I hope these answers helped, and if they did, please drop a comment and subscribe.